Bonjour, je m'appelle Vincent Piel. Je suis ici pour vous présenter. Hello, this is Vincent Piel, and we would like to show you the new Leader 46 from Jano. After the very successful launch of the Leader 36 and Leader 40, Jano is now releasing the Leader 46, the flagship of the Leader line. We invite you to come aboard and discover this truly remarkable boat. The new Leader 46 is born of the same DNA as the other boats in the Leader line. The sporty hull is developed by J&J &J Design, and the sleek profile of the Leader 46 is the result of the brilliant work from Garoni Design, an Italian design firm well known in the Geno universe. In terms of powertrain, the boat is available with a choice of stern drive D6 370 or 400 engines, or IPS 500 or 600 with up to 2 times 435 horsepower. Both options are Volvo diesel engines. Whichever type of engine you choose, IPS or stern drive, you'll be able to maneuver with ease thanks to the joystick control system, which makes piloting even a boat of this size a breeze. The new Leader 46 is an express cruiser with sleek and sporty styling, with the helm station protected by a hard top that can be fully opened to the outside. This boat is the closed hard top version, an option chosen by the owner. It includes a bay window system at the rear and a door to starboard. The electric bay window retracts up to the ceiling to get all the advantages of an open-top express speedboat, combined with the advantages of the closed hardtop for off-season protection. The closed hardtop solution chosen by Jano for this version has a bay window to the rear that lifts completely under the hardtop ceiling with an automatic locking system for use during navigation. The second advantage is the absence of a central column, so the space is completely open towards the aft. Outside, the Leader 46 offers three separate living areas for the best onboard comfort, even with many guests. On the bow, you will find a sun deck. Under the hardtop, there is a friendly living area with a large U-shaped saloon next to the cockpit. Getting around on board is ideal with a one-level layout from the sun deck to the companionway. And as with the other boats in the line, the Leader 36 and 40, we find a built-in sun deck on the aft deck. The advantage of this built-in sun deck is to preserve the friendly feeling of the saloon table while also using the sun deck without having to make any adjustments. Under the built-in aft sun deck, there is a large storage space, space for the life raft, or a good amount of equipment. Below the sun deck, as a standard feature, there is a very deep, tender stowage. Very deep. Which makes stowing the tender quick and easy. While on a longer cruise, the tender can also be stored on the rear platform, while the stowage is used to store equipment and various gear. Also on the aft deck, to enhance the outside living space and the connection to swimming activities, there is an optional kitchen hidden under a cushion. 
This complements the top deck kitchen located under the hardtop. This outdoor kitchen, equipped with a grill and a sink, is a friendly living space and allows the cooks to keep visiting with the other guests enjoying the water while barbecuing. Future owners also have the choice of aft deck layouts. The built-in sun deck can be replaced by a bench seat facing aft. This leaves a large passage here and creates a second living space in the rear. This option is compatible with both the tender stowage, always a standard feature, and the optional platform kitchen. The aft swim platform has an optional hydraulic lifting system to facilitate launching the tender and to make the swimming platform easy to use. So there are three sun decks on board. The sun deck beneath the hard top, which is well sheltered, the built-in sun deck aft, and a third on the bow, which we'll go and see now. The bow sun deck is a real invitation to relax on board. It is quite large and well equipped. There's an outdoor shower on deck that offers some refreshment without having to go below. There are cup holders and special pads equipped with an adjustable backrest system. This all makes for a really nice living space on the bow. Please come discover the boat's interior. The spacious hardtop is equipped with a large electric sunroof. which opens in a few seconds and transforms the deck into a large open top. Under the hard top, there is a large U-shaped saloon with a large table. Opposite the saloon is the standard outdoor kitchen. The countertop is arranged under hinged covers and can be equipped with a sink and various equipment such as a grill. There is a refrigerator, cupboards and storage below the countertop. The helm station on the Leader 46 is to starboard. The ergonomic layout with all the controls right at hand, features an adjustable helm, a handrail to hold on to, and matte black surfaces to reduce glare. The bench is a two-seater for tandem navigation with bolster-type adjustable seat cushions. Facing the cockpit is a second living space for co-pilots or guests with a bench and daybed type seating facing the sea. The unit is easily transformable into a large, light-filled sun deck thanks to the open sunroof. but which remains protected from the wind by the windshield. The conversion is very simple. The board and cushion are stowed in place and are installed in seconds. Now let me invite you below deck to discover the remarkable interior that is both innovative and very luxurious.
The atmosphere is very calm, with a contemporary look that has been redesigned to the last detail. There are large hull windows on each side of the cabin, newly designed furniture in white lacquer, new walnut woodwork, and the use of new materials for a finish of impeccable quality. The new indirect lighting is an integral part of the serene feeling of the interior. These interior lights are both ambient and also the main cabin lights and provide a soft light that is diffused throughout the interior. The saloon is spacious with plenty of comfortable seating, with the sofa-like backrest cushions similar to fine home furniture. Facing the saloon there is a TV, a cabinet bar, and also a luxurious, fully equipped kitchen with plenty of storage space. Storage space everywhere. The finish is again in white lacquer. There is, if I may insist, ample storage all around. A very large fridge of 190 liters, a combined oven microwave, and yet more storage space under the companionway for a maximized use of space. It is also possible to install a washing machine or a wine cellar under the companionway and a dishwasher under the sink. There is also further storage space located under the floor. The Leader 46 is available in two or three cabin layouts. In the three cabin layout, the saloon is replaced by a complete bulkhead with a door lots of storage and two bunk beds, making it a beautiful third cabin. This layout works perfectly with the closed hardtop because the saloon is transferred to the main deck. Now onto the very comfortable front cabin. It has a large central double berth. If need be, the berth has a separation system and opens into two simple berths. The cabin has hull windows that let in natural light and offer a good view of the sea. Here we also have plenty of upper level storage space all around the cabin, again with the white lacquer finish. There's also a large wardrobe. And you will notice the attention to detail, such as the fabric bulkhead lining in Alcantara, which brings both softness to the touch and helps reduce noise levels on board. It would be easy to believe that this aft cabin is the owner's cabin. Though it is very comfortable, it is not. There is in fact a true owner's suite located to the aft. Before we have a visit, let's have a look at the adjoining bathroom here in the forward cabin. It is very comfortable and remarkably spacious. It has a separate shower and toilet, good level of comfort and plenty of space especially around the sink. Now I would like to show you the centerpiece of the new Leader 46, a truly remarkable and absolutely unprecedented owner suite. It has very good headroom throughout the length of the cabin. It's spacious. It has a large double berth in the center of the boat 
around which one can move freely in order to access the generous storage space situated starboard. There are large hull windows on both sides. And finally, the unique feature of this fantastic owner's suite is the option of opening the cabin to port through the bathroom and thus enlarging the cabin space. One simply opens the glass doors, which can be smoked glass for greater privacy, which then close the shower to the right and the separate toilet to the left. This bathroom is also spacious, has plenty of storage, a remarkable finish with these dual position doors, large mirrors, and again the fabric bulkhead lining in Alcantara. The new Leader 46 is notable above all for its fine quality fit and finish. It was designed for speed lovers and comfortable cruising. So we finished our tour. I hope that you enjoyed it and invite you, if you would like to learn more about the Leader 46, to contact your Jeannot dealer or come discover the boat at the next show.